is he doing? What is he standing on? If you have met him, you already seen it. So it's Buck the Beaver. And what is he standing on? You seriously? Buck the Beaver, you like the control panels, huh? <laughs> yep. That's right. We're going to be doing another fire alarm tour. So, once again, I'm System Sensor 250, and guys, welcome back to another brand new video. So, guys, today we are going to be doing another fire alarm tour and hunting. So, hope everybody did have an amazing day. So, you remember in the previous app? At this previous uh, fire alarm tour, as we actually done the EST Edwards at the Raven Ravens Ford High School in Panama City Beach, Florida. So this time we have another EST Edwards system. We're gonna be doing the full tour. This time we're at the Church of Jesus Christ Light Day Sings in Valleyville, Florida. Hope everybody did have an amazing day. Before guys get started, make sure you guys don't forget to smash the subscribe, like, and don't forget to smash the bell button. If you do guys have any questions, you know what to do. Just tell me in the comments or tell me on Discord as well too, aka my Discord server. Anyways guys, and also today is Thanksgiving, so make sure you uh, celebrate your families uh, and also happy Thanksgiving as well too. <laughs> Anyways guys, Let's go ahead and get started the amazing full tour. So this time we have another Edwards. So anyways, let's start off with the control panel. All right, let's start off with the uh, emergency command center. And then after that, we'll move on to the uh, control panel. So we're gonna do a full tour with the emergency command. So right here we have is the firelight uh, ECC ECC-50 slash 100 uh, emergency command center. So basically, what they, why did they actually install that? It's because all of the fire alarm system has a voice evacuation. So here's the microphone. So you can actually pick it up and then there should be a button right here to start speaking for the fire alarms. It's more like a laptop. talk. <laughs> so, like the beaver again. So, anyways, let's move on to the control panel. And moving on to the control panel, we have a amazing, this is actually what it looks like with the uh, panel. There's my Bucky's t-shirt. So, we have is the Edwards IO 64G SP. IO series fire alarm control panel. This is actually what the main control panel. Let's see, I think it's actually still open. So you can actually see the inside. If I can get it open. Try to get this one handed. There we go. This is what it looks like on the inside. This chemist is that's focused. There we go. So this one, you have noticed, is actually set. So this one's actually set alarm. And we have main reason. We have a kitchen hood. Um, I think it's because they're actually um, looks like they're actually um, we upgrading the kitchen. So that's why they causes the fire alarm to go off. So didn't notice that. Anyways, guys, we'll go ahead and move on onto the, uh, so first off, we're going to head over is the, we're going to start off with the uh, pole stations first, and then smoke detectors, and the final is going to be the fire alarm, which is the speaker strobe. So we got those two so far, so let's move on to the pole station. Buck the beaver, let's do this. All right, we actually move on to the first control panel. I mean, the pull station. Sorry, I already said pull station. I mean, the control panel, I already said that right there. So, I'm sure to admit, the pull station. Alright, so we have Honeywell 5140 MPS-2. It's 
It's like you buy Honeywell as well. <laughs> it's right here. If you can actually see some reflection in the moment, you can see a reflection as my bucket, the beaver is actually on top of my shoulder. <laughs> so you can see that. <laughs> Anyways, that's the first control panel. So let's go ahead and move on to the next one. All right, we have a compare with the uh, old school uh, pull station here. So we have a EST Edwards Ziga-270 pull station. It's actually covered. So you just have to lift here and then pull it. I'm not sure there's a uh, thing like a speaker in here. Looks like there's not. So, yep. EST Ziga-270 is actually kind of a little bit more popular with one of these. So yeah, it's pretty cool. So, looks like they're doing like a whole entire uh, pull station of the uh, EST, EST Edwards 270, 270. So, the whole entire thing. There might be some that is actually uh, Honeywell and something like that, so who knows. And now we'll go ahead and move on since we got the uh, the pulse station. I'm just going to show you a quick demo what all of the, uh, the fire alarm pulse stations they have installed. So we will go ahead and move on to the uh, smoke detector switches right here. So we'll be getting to that in just a moment. So, yeah, it's pretty awesome. Anyways, let's move on to the smoke detectors. All right, guys. We're now in the uh, smoke detectors now. Uh, where's these smoke detectors? There's one right here. And the one that's closer is right here. We have a EST Ziga HF dash. Sorry, we have a Ziga dash HFS smoke detector. It's actually pretty uh, unique old school smoke detectors. There's the EST. If you can actually see that. There you go, now you can see it. So, yep. And to round it, here's another EST Edwards. Say good. <laughs> Some pulsations and smoke detectors. And now we will go ahead and move on onto the uh, the final, final, final video. The speaker strobe. And now we'll move on to the final fire alarm system of the Edwards is the fire alarm speaker strobe. We have is the Edwards uh, 757-8A-RS25. This is actually basically a speaker strobe. I can actually touch that. <laughs> so yeah, it's actually pretty awesome. Anyways, that's the uh, all of the uh, fire alarm system. So we'll go ahead and move head back to the control panel for the actual duction. All right, looks like we're back at the uh, control panel. So. This is actually a pretty amazing experience of the uh, the tour of the uh, the uh, ESC Edwards fire alarm systems. So let's go ahead and wrap. What do you guys think of the uh, the fire alarm hunting so far, and also the full tour? Let me know in the comments. Oh yes, thank you. Anyways, guys, that's going to be the end of the today's video. I hope everybody did, guys, enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Now, guys, before we guys end, make sure you guys don't forget to smash the subscribe, like, and don't forget to smash the bell button. If you do guys have any questions, you know what to do. Just chat me in the comments or chat me on Discord, as far to you, aka my Discord server. Make sure you guys uh, don't forget to check out my latest video through on my homepage, as far to you. Make sure you uh, guys don't forget to check out my second, third, and fourth YouTube channel. Smash the subscribe and those channels. I'll be super appreciated. So, anyways, guys, you have a, a great Thanksgiving out here. 
Hope everybody did have an amazing, wonderful time, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.